lost the coin flip. That's okay. Oh my gosh. Why are we getting no basics? These hands have been garbage for the last little bit. The last couple games, the hands have just been not good. That was hilarious. In hindsight, I probably should have detached the energy, retreated the Charmander. Yeah, in hindsight, I probably should have retreated the Charmander and um, Of course you got ahead. That has also been the story of my life tonight. People getting heads on everything. Take that. That was upsetting. Maybe I should just make those level balls in hindsight. Hey, sweet Smurf, how are you doing tonight? Welcome to the stream. We are currently playing Pokemon trading card game online, rocking it out with Charizard. If I can get into a boss's orders, I'm going to knock this Orokoro out. Because Dance of Tribute is annoying. Okay, with that, we have switches.
It is, this lack of Charmander is kind of hurting a little bit. Won't lie. Play that just to shuffle it up. How have I not seen a Charmander or a single way to get to a Charmander? Well, here comes the big boy. Oh, God. It's only going to be 150, though, so... Wait. How did I get... A oh, because of the double energies. Okay, so we kind of lose here, don't we? If we don't get into another Charmander, we sure do. Okay, this lack of Charmander has killed me more than my opponent has this turn. This game. Literally, the lack of Charmander has hurt me more than anything else. If there's no boss's orders here, though, and I can knock out this Primeape, we're in a really good position. There's the boss's orders. Oh, he went with the Zamazenta. The Zacian. I'm actually okay with that. The other Charmander out here. Catch that there. Yeah, that Primeape has got to go next turn. If he does not Marnie me, that Primeape is so dead. If I don't get Marnied, there it is.
Okay, so let's get rid of this first of all. You will attach that there. We'll play that. Bring that up. You. Yeah, come here, you. Get out of my face. It doesn't even matter. I, I doesn't even matter. I have the HP. I have the attack power to knock out anything I want. We're feeling really good about this, guys. Really, really good. We didn't play Marnie, but I literally have game. We're going to take this Orokoro and we're going to knock it out. Yeah, we win. Yeah, he knew it. He knew it. As soon as I, as soon as I played the Eldegoss, he knew we had game. That deck was scary. I like it. Hella fun. We won the coin flip. Okay, we want to go first. What is with this deck? Man, my past three games, I haven't, I don't think I've gotten a single basic Pokemon at the start of my turn. These hands, these hands have been hot garbage with this deck. Hot garbage. Uh, Bring up the Rachi, Stellar Wish. None of that is helpful. Like, in the slightest. Interesting. I kind of love the level balls back in the format. I might have to use them. If I'm having an issue getting Charmanders, I might have to use uh, play some level balls.
Okay. There we go. Now we can get something going on. Play that. And play that to get rid of that. Got two fire energies. That was upsetting. I think I think it's clear that we need to be focusing on our attention on the Salandits. Yes, it's very clear we need to be focusing our attention on the Salandits. Those salazzles could hurt us immensely. Okay with that. Oh, that was actually really good. I'm confused with the point of the bell sprouts though, I'm not gonna lie. more handy. What's his play here? What's he going to do? So he needs to have a team yell horn. What do you do? Never mind, he does not need a team yell horn. That one actually hurts a little bit. Oh, well, maybe not. That was not helpful. That was also not helpful. I would rather you take this two this two prizes than take my Charmeleon. Hey Meg, what's going on? Yes, this is what the codes go to. Whenever you get a Pokemon booster pack, the code you get opens up a car a pack of the same set on Pokemon Trading Card Game. And you use those cards and you can build decks you can trade. Um, when you buy starter decks, you get the starter deck online. When you buy tins, you get a tin. You get a deck made from the Pokemon on the tin. So yeah, and then you come on here and you play. This is pretty much all we've been playing lately because I can't go to um, Pokemon tournaments in real life. So right now we are playing a Charizard deck, and it's not drawing well for us at all. We're going to lose this, but that's okay. That's 
it's fine. Up here. That was not helpful. That. Really, I only have one energy left in deck. That's upsetting. It is really cool. Please give me a Charizard. Thank you. Yep, so the game ends when you no longer have... So the game ends when your opponent takes all six of their prizes, or you no longer have any Pokemon on your bench. Or you run out of cards, which in my case happens a lot. Battle sense. So after you draw your opening hand of seven cards, the top six cards of your deck go into your prize zone. And whenever you knock out one of your opponent's Pokemon, you take a prize and add it to your hand. And then whenever all six prizes are taken, like what's about to happen here, does he have the, does he have the twin energy though? If he doesn't have the twin energy, I'm in good position here. He might not have it. Oh, I don't think he does. Does he have the twin energy? I don't think he does. Yeah, he does. Of course I do. Oof. Yeah, then when all six prize cards are taken, then I lose. Now, there are like... So when you knock out a Pokemon, you get one prize card. When you knock out a Pokemon V, you get two prize cards. Okay, I have a switch, so no, you know, I'll make that active. Get rid of that. Another Charmander in hand. Yes. You. Okay. How is none of that a Charizard? Oh my gosh. Bet you they're prized. So the prize cards actually add a bit of challenge to the game because right away you're six cards short and the prize cards could be anything. Like I could have two Charizards in here. I'm pretty sure I do. Yeah. So two of my Charizards are prized. So because two of my Charizards are prized, I'm probably going to lose this game. I'm going to depend on what that last card is. The good thing here is I don't think the Salazzle can poison me again. Never mind. He's just going to Koga me. No, 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 no. He doesn't get... So the cards that he gets... He takes his prizes. So you see there, he just knocked me out and he took one of these cards. No, 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 no. No.
Okay. So we are taking a big risk here. Got one. We got one. Yeah, that sucked. No, no, no. Okay, so, like, I just knocked out his Pokemon, and I took one of my prize cards and added it to my hand. That'd be crazy if they could keep your cards, but we've lost. Having two Charizards in the prizes kind of screwed me over a little bit. Yeah, because there's no way I can take three prizes in this turn. That's upsetting. Upsetting. Yeah, he knows he does. He doesn't have to attack. He knows it. I had one more turn. If I had one more turn, I could have won this. He has draws, says go. Oh, he's gonna go for the kill. Nice. Yeah. Good night. Yeah. That was a good game. Having the two Charizards in the prizes, Charizard wins. Oh. Letting me go first. That's dangerous. Starting with a Zigzagoon, that is also dangerous. Hoping that he sees that I don't have, that he won't Marnie me if I just play the one card. Him playing a Hearth works out for us. Okay, that is getting clipped for 